Harry just said to Matt that uh, for the first hour this afternoon, everybody must have been really pleased with the way it was going, but then uh, one goal goes in and made it made it a difficult afternoon. Yeah, I completely agree with you. Um, we went in at half-time, we was, um happy with how the game was going and uh, we executed our game plan really well. Um, funny enough, I said at half-time, half whatever the only way we're going to lose this is for a mistake, and unfortunately, that's what's happened. And then after that, it's an uphill battle because... It's a tough place to come. Uh, it's a tough place to come, and we're very aware that they've kept a lot of clean sheets this year. Um, they've got a solid back line, so after that, it's an uphill battle. But mm. as you said, for the first 60, 65 minutes, I thought we looked mm. quite strong. Uh, we had a great shape. We limited them to not very many chances. They've hit the crossbar from a free kick, but other than that, I don't believe they had too many chances. So mm. it's, it's frustrating, but there's lots of positive sides in the first 60. But we've just got to regroup them now to next week. Just Craig Eastman, Craig Eastman, just in front of the in front of the back four. It was an unfamiliar formation we were playing in today. So you normally see him in, in the in the mid in the midfield four, but in front of the back four, and then you and Ali in the in the middle. How did how did you were you feeling that work well? Yeah, um, if I'm honest with you, um, as you as you all know, we've had a tricky time of late with injuries. I know all teams do, but we've had um, we've had many injuries, and then obviously we're very aware they play a free midfield um, with a lot of rotation. So. Uh, we matched up in there, and to be honest with you, I believe the three of us kept them very quiet. Kept the three of them very quiet for the first 60. Um, there weren't a lot in the game whatsoever, so we, we're as pleased with how it is going. But um, we've got three of us got legs that can run out all over teams, and as I said, I felt as if we kept them quiet. But as I said, once I went to one 0 it was an uphill battle. But it is. Um, it's unfamiliar for Eastie, but he's put in a good shift, and I think the three of us have in there. Yes, and, and in the second half, just before they scored, got the feeling we were becoming a little bit more of an attacking force as well. Yeah, well, listen, we, we always want to attack as much as we can. Um, when you're coming away to places like this, sometimes you've got to be patient. So I feel as if as the, the longer the game went on without us conceding, um, the more chances we'd get because they're going to attack us that little bit more and um, leave a few, few more gaps. So it's frustrating the time they scored at, to be honest, because it's getting into the t territory where Dow's going to have to start taking some risk and it had left, left um, spaces for us. So it is unfortunate, but as you said, I feel as if we could have really kicked mm. on after that 60-minute mark. And then, then once the goal's gone in, obviously the, the emphasis changes slightly from stopping them scoring to trying to get one of our own and, and couldn't didn't really, if we were honest, attack too, sort of create too much in the last half hour. Yeah, you're right. It was, um, I think it's one of them ones where you've got to be careful. You don't want to go all guns blazing and leave yourself short, but then at the same time, the later it goes, the more nervy they get and there's more chance of an equaliser. Mm. But to be fair to them, now their back line was very strong today. Um, so it was hard, but on another day, maybe things go our way a bit more mm. and it would have been a different game. And now from your point of view, um, back got, got some minutes last week and then an hour, hour again today. How's, how's it feeling after being out for a while? Yeah, it, was, um, it, it maybe was a bit a couple of weeks longer than I expected and I had hoped, but... The last couple of weeks, um, trained well, felt getting sharper and sharper um, by as the training sessions have gone on. And I feel as if I'm back now, it's just a matter of just mm. trying to build up the minutes. Um, we've got a very um, hectic period coming up over Christmas where all bodies going to be needed. So mm. it's important that we try and keep everyone fit now and um, go on another little run. Yeah, and you say three games in just over a just under a week yeah. um, after after Christmas, as you say, the, the whole squad's going to be needed. So it's important the players are now coming back. You and Ali now coming back, yeah. sort of getting close to full fitness. Yeah, you're right. It's a lot of games in a short space of time, a lot of minutes. So as you just said, everyone's going to be needed. So it's important that we train well. So when we're called upon, we're ready for it. And still not a lot in the in the league. You no, know, a decent Christmas and could push us push us well, well into the top half of the table. And the second half of the season with players coming back, that must be what's, what we're what we're looking at. That's it. It's all about trying to go on another little run now. We've got some um, fixtures at home where we've always been strong at home. Um, we're getting players back, so it's uh, important that we try and stay injury free for, free from now to the end of the season. Go on another little run, but. To be honest, I'm not one for excuses. We've been hit hard with injuries this season and it does affect the squad, but it's all important now that we get everyone back and we go on another little run. Um, and also, Harry, just talk, talking about the fans today, over 500 here at, uh, at Brisbane Road on a, in, a, in a big crowd. It must, yep. must have been great to see all that support. Yeah, definitely. Um, they've travelled in numbers today and it does. you do notice it as a player on a pitch when you see that amount of um, fans that have travelled to watch you. So uh, all the boys are fully aware of it. We really much appreciate it and um, it does go a long way with us. So... We can't thank them enough. Um, I believe last year they um, we bought a really good following as well. So it's something that we're aware of, and it does um, it does spur us on that on a little bit more. Brilliant. Thanks a lot, Harry. No Cheers. Problem.